We all know who Kevin Durant is. He's one of the greatest small forwards to ever play the game. For the past 12 NBA seasons, he's been wrecking havoc in the league and solidifying himself as one of the greatest scorers of all time. Trying to stay with Durant, knocks it away and Durant's limping. Durant goes down holding his leg, Ibaka goes up and is fouled down the other end. And Durant to grabbing that player, right leg who gets injured. It's the right calf that put him out. And this came to a halt in the 2019 NBA Finals when Kevin Durant went down with one of the most devastating injuries, a ruptured Achilles in his right leg. This injury has changed the course of basketball. And the hard truth is, the tough pill to swallow is, Kevin Durant will likely never be the same player again. We are not saying he won't be a good player. We're not even saying he won't be an all-star. But he won't be that player who went to three straight NBA Finals and won back-to-back -back Finals MVPs. That Kevin Durant is realistically done. What is an Achilles rupture? A YouTuber by the name of Brian Sutterer, MD, makes content primarily on athletes and the injuries they have sustained. He provided an in-depth analysis of Kevin Durant's injuries, which I'll link below. But in short, it is the Achilles tendon located at the back of your ankle bursting. When looking at previous players who have tore their Achilles and how it affected their play, we stumbled across a paper published in 2013 studying the effects of an NBA player's performance after the repair of a complete Achilles rupture. The study looked at 18 players from 1988 to 2011 who have tore their Achilles tendon. Of those 18, 7 never suited up again for an NBA game and 3 would go on to play a season. This includes Hall of Fame player Isaiah Thomas and one-time All-Star Mehmet Okur. Of the remaining 8, we graphed their player efficiency rating a season up to and prior to the injury and 2 years removed. The graph displayed that every player's player efficiency rating regressed after an Achilles injury. When viewing more recent candidates of the Achilles injury, we looked at Wesley Matthews, DeMarcus Cousins, and Kobe Bryant. Each of their PER had declined and it was visually evident they weren't the same player as before, losing much of their athleticism and being more susceptible to other injuries. We've seen this in Kobe Bryant when he returned from his Achilles injury. He played 6 games and was ruled out for the rest of the season. A more recent example is DeMarcus Cousins. Not even a full year removed from returning from his Achilles rupture, he tears his quad and then his ACL. The history of Achilles ruptures is not in favor with Kevin Durant. We have to look at his age now. Durant is currently 31 years old. He'll be 32 when he resumes play and will likely need a year of basketball under his belt for proper footing. This leaves him at the age of 33. When you're 33, your best years are behind you. You're in your decline. You're just not as quick or strong and your body is not as responsive as it was before. Many Hall of Fame players that are healthy at this age on their last legs or riding the bench. Father Prime is against you during this time and he is undefeated. Will this be the final game of the NBA season? Toronto one win away, but all of a sudden the return of the Warriors most lethal offensive weapon. Just more great theater in the NBA Finals. June 10th, 2019 was likely the last time we have ever truly seen Kevin Durant dropping 11 points in 12 minutes in Game 5 of the NBA Finals. Age and history is simply against him. But there is a shimmer of hope we might get to see Kevin Durant for a short period of time play at the elite level he did. This form of hope comes in Dominique Wilkins. Dominique is an outlier. 
he tore his Achilles at the age of 32. History and time wasn't on his side, but he returned the following NBA season, averaging nearly 30 points and receiving an all-star selection and an all-NBA team selection. This is what we hope for, because he is. Hey, I'm Kevin Durant. You know who I am. Y'all know who I am. <laughs> Guys, before you leave, don't forget to show the channel some love. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And also check out the other videos I released. I'll see you all next time.